All right, so we're back, and for better or for worse, we're back to Twitter. As of today, I will never take a road trip due to only three to four stalls per charging location. So we're actually entering the bigger is better debate, are we? Sounds like it, yeah. And certainly when we talk about charging stations, the more chargers at a location, the merrier. And we're already expanding the size uh, of our network. Today, or historically, I should say, we have had one and two stall sites with 50 kilowatt chargers at them. Uh, going forward, we're building six to eight stall sites that have 350 kilowatt chargers. So we're making dramatic improvements uh, in the number of stalls that are available for our customers. Fantastic. Yeah, I mean, we are building stations today that need to serve the growth in five years of EV adoption that we're expecting. We've implemented what we call simultaneous charging or power sharing, which actually enables us to share the total power across charging stalls and even across the site to all the vehicles that are there, optimizing the amount of power that we can deliver to every vehicle that's charging. And our drivers really want to have confidence that when they get to one of our sites, there'll be a charger available. Yeah, they do. And for that, we've actually introduced reservations. And with that, customers can basically pick a charger that they're going to be at in the next 20 to 30 minutes if they're on a trip, reserve it, and it will be theirs when they get there. So today you can use OpenTable to reserve your favorite restaurant or the EVgo app to reserve your favorite charger. What if I want to have a charger at my favorite restaurant? I think that could be arranged.